thank you very much, uh, Mr. Chair. This this committee and Parliament in general have been seized for some time with the Arrive scam scandal. Uh, there have been many shocking revelations over the uh, previous months. Uh, the latest, uh, further, is that one of the people at the center of this scandal was both an external contractor receiving money on Arrive Can and a government employee uh, at the same time uh, was receiving millions of dollars uh, supposedly as an external uh, contractor uh, for what work we still don't know and was a government employee and the government apparently doesn't know enough about who its employees are uh, in order to have noticed this at some point earlier in the process. Um, with that in mind, Mr. Chair, and I do hope this is a simple matter of housekeeping, I would like to see, before, we, uh, before I move on to my questions, if we have the agreement of the committee uh, that we issue a summons for Mr. Yao to appear before the committee within seven days and for at least two hours. I hope that's simply a matter we can have agreement of the committee uh, on so we can move on. If there's a government member that wants to speak to it, you're welcome to, uh, but you're, uh, you can speak to it, you can accept it or reject it. Well, as, as a member of this uh, committee, I um, object to a motion of that nature being sprung on us in that uh, way, and uh, no, I do not give unanimous consent. Uh, thank you, Chair. I, I thought this would have been a matter of, of obvious and simple housekeeping that the committee, uh, as part of its Arrive Can work, would want to hear from Mr. Uh, David Yao. Uh, I'm, I'm sorry to see the Liberals uh, blocking us from moving forward on this in an expeditious manner, uh, but Conservatives will bring this back to the committee at the earliest opportunity uh, in order to uh, proceed with a decision on summoning Mr. Yao to appear before the committee. The fact that he was able to be both a uh, arrive scam contractor and a government employee and that supposedly nobody noticed uh, is really the height of absurdity. Uh, so uh, unfortunately with, with the Liberals blocking this, it'll be a notice of motion for the moment, but I will bring it back at the earliest opportunity. The notice of, the, of motion is that the committee issue a summons for Mr. David Yao to appear before the committee within seven days and for at least two hours.